artist today is classically trained as a violinist, and by the age of 12, he began writing songs and teaching himself the guitar. I'm already jealous. Yeah, me too. He <laughs> views music as healing and therapy, and we all need that these days. Please welcome Bobby Donnelly, man. How are you doing, man? I'm good. How are you guys? Good, good. We're doing great. We're doing great. Okay, so... I'm hearing you get a little classic rock. Mm -hmm. You mix a little little funk and soul into the mix, and a little Eagles. How, how do you do all that, man? Yeah, it's uh, it's kind of one of those. Uh, you know, you kind of other people kind of hear where your inspirations come from, and you're like, oh, I can put that together because. Genre is kind of a weird thing, but whenever people are like, you know, at a at a gig, or like, oh, you make your own music, what do you play? Right. Or like, what's it like? You're always like, especially today, there are so many things out there. Oh, absolutely. It's kind of hard to describe, but yeah, the best concise is like John Mayer, Maroon 5, little bit of the Eagles, kind of. I can hear that now in my touch head. Touch your bases, I yeah. <laughs> Maroon 5, I mean, I, look, I can jig to Maroon 5. Influence is important. What would you say is the influence of your music? Hmm, influence of my music, um, I was actually just talking about this earlier when I got here. Stevie Ray Vaughan, first of all, the reason I picked up a guitar, I was, I was like, I want to do that. Absolutely. I was like, that's the thing. I was like, I want to be able to do that. Um, and then, yeah, just as I got a little bit older and kind of into high school and acoustic guitar, wanting to then write songs that I could, you know, attempt my best <laughs> Stevie Ray Vaughan, you know, on top mm -hmm. of and kind of put the pieces together. I need him to play Stevie Ray Vaughan on the violin. Right, exactly. That's what I need. Ooh, when you come back, because you know, we're okay. family here, so when you come back, oh, yeah. I have a thing about violinists. You know, yeah. even at my wedding, we had an electric violinist. Nice. Uh -huh. Absolutely. A little hip hop violinist, uh -huh. actually. Okay, now, man, we are holding uh, one of your albums, but you have something new coming, right? Yes, we have not an official release date yet, but in the fall, I'll have a second album coming out. Uh, super exciting, but yes, y'all have the first round that. Excuse me, first one right there, and that's, um, yeah, available, Spotify, iTunes, all that good stuff. Awesome. What are you going to be playing for us today? Uh, so today, um, this is funny, it's just a good acoustic song to play. Not on the second album, so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, you'll have to wait longer, uh, but it's called Touchdown. Um, and, yeah, one of those that kind of came to me at the, at the beginning of all of this, that kind of, you know, COVID and everything that we've gone through. Yeah. and just kind of one of those little songwriter moments and mm. yeah we're healing yes we're absolutely like those. Got we it. like those well bobby donnelly the floor is yours thank you so much i haven't seen you in quite a while that face and I miss your smile You didn't mean to hurt me but you did Immortalized in oblivion Touchdown, touchdown Cause I hate this town I never 
without a the day where love and time and space are rearranging Cause someone knows I'm changing A touchdown Cause now I want someone Yes I found someone who pulls me to the ground <laughs> All right. Touchdown! Yeah. Touchdown! <laughs> Touchdown! <laughs> Touchdown. <laughs>